Dad, please call us back. We're starting to get worried. Uh, TK. Oh, babe, thank God you're here. Something's going on with my dad, and we don't know where he is. You should talk in private. OK. TK, your father was taken into custody this morning. What do you mean, custody? It means he's been arrested. Arrested? For what? I don't know all the details, but it looks like ours. It, that's, that's wrong. That's, that's, I mean, that has to be a mistake. He, he reported an arson, and nobody believed him. Well, ex except for your dad. I mean, Carlos, call your dad, and he'll clear everything up, right? TK, it was the Texas Rangers that served the warrant. My dad was the arresting officer. What? I'm sorry. You're sorry? He's out of his mind if he thinks my dad is an arsonist, Carlos. TK, we don't have all the facts. What is that supposed to mean? Just what I said. We don't know what's going on here, but I do know my father, and he would never make an arrest without a good reason. And I know mine, and he's not a criminal. I didn't say he was. Yeah, but your dad is, and it seems like you're defending him. I mean, come on, how does he not know that he's got the wrong man? He was with him for three hours last night. What are we talking about? More like an hour. Your dad is two hours late. Remember? He was stuck in traffic getting your stupid limes. There was no pile up on Mopac last night. I called dispatch. You checked up on my dad's story. Only because you were starting to feel like a story. Really? So you're saying it now? Hmm? You saying my dad's a criminal, Carlos? Are you saying my dad's a criminal? Whose side are you on? Answer me, man! Let uh, go of me! Stop me! Stop me! Leave me. Leave Carlos, me. I think you need to go. Hey, babe. Hope you came hungry. Just put the chicken in the oven. What is this? You don't have to do all this. If my boyfriend's firehouse is going to blow up in the middle of a shift, I'm going to make the most of it. Hi. Hi. Listen, about the other blow up at the firehouse. TK, we agreed. Nobody has to apologize. Our dads did what they had to do. We were collateral damage. Seriously, since when have our dads become world-class con artists? My dad spent 40 years going after thieves and scammers, so I guess some of that rubbed off. So then, what's my dad's excuse? <laughs>